Well, here I go on down the road. It's been a while since I made a writing video. Yeah, it's been a while since I made a video. Uh, let's see, I believe it was February, about February 9th or so. It's the last writing video or video where I was writing. But a lot of things have been happening since then. You know, one of the reasons why I haven't been making videos, the first part is a few months since February is I was involved in buying a new house and, uh, you know, moving and things of that sort. The moving part, you know, I did little by little until I got everything but the big furniture hauled and then my son and some of his friends helped me, uh, move that stuff so we actually didn't get moved in you know what was it april or so yeah april end of april and uh but it finally got moved into the new place and I, i'm trying to get settled in and everything other things that's been going on though i'm dealing with a few uh medical issues you know and uh Back in March, was it March? Yeah. Back in March, actually, uh, we moved, it was the end of February now, I think about it. But uh, back in March, I saw my primary care physician, and, and after he reviewed all my blood work and everything, it turns out that uh, I finally made the the old age bucket list of coming down with diabetes yeah that's great right you know my sugar had been slowly creeping up over the last few years and finally I got to the point where I'm diagnosed with diabetes and uh, I've had to change my diet and things about that but on top of that he noticed something about my blood tests that were indicating that I might have something what they call a fatty liver. My primary care, he set me up with the, the liver clinic there at the Veterans Administration. Well, I had an ultrasound done first, and then I went to the liver clinic, and they did another ultrasound. One, The second one really hurt because they put this thing on my back, and it throbbed, I guess, to send a vibrations down to my liver after the doctor reviewed that and another doctor reviewed that I got diagnosed as saying I have cirrhosis of the liver not just fatty liver disease which I really don't understand because I quit drinking totally back in 2005 you know uh, and uh, really over the last I don't know, 35 years or more, or more than that, almost oh, over the last 40 years, you know, uh, I didn't, you know, most of the time I didn't drink at all, but I did go back to drinking some in the 90s and in the early 2000s, but uh, I decided I needed to quit because I was afraid I was going to get something like cirrhosis of the liver or other health problems, and uh, and so I thought... You know, I was hedging my bets by uh, quitting when I did. But here, 18 years later, I get, after totally giving up alcohol altogether, you know, that means giving up whiskey, giving up beer, or anything, you know, except for communion wine um, at communion. But, uh, I, I didn't think I was in danger any longer to get cirrhosis of the liver. But I did. Anyways, I'm out. It's a nice, beautiful morning. I'm going to head over to Rock City Harley Davidson, which is about 30 miles away now, where it used to be 10 miles away. If you like this video, hit like. Don't forget to subscribe. 